Come on, generate. Do seventy five. We bit overzealous. Dish Mario Lottery. Another casino. What the hell? What in the name of hell is this? This can't pot. This is not a licensed game, is it? This is some sort of hack or something. And it's playing itself, by the way. I'm not. I'm not doing anything. I have no idea what the hell is going on. Oh, hey, it's musical though. It's like an awesome MIDI keyboard. What what's going on? No, stop being a key. You stop being a keyboard. I got some bars, some Hershey bars. Those are pretty good. Every button randomly corresponds to some little note, basically. It's awesome music time. Oh, awesome music time is over. And Mario's teeth are bleeding, by the way. Mario has gingivitis. He did not brush his teeth well. Yep. Did I click out? It's not letting me do anything. Well, this is obviously a hack and it sucks, so let's find an actual game. I didn't... Well, I guess I didn't know there were hacks in that, so... Regenerate. 13. Damn it! 13. Right at the freaking back. What do we got here? Wizards and Warriors. Hey! What did you do? Wizards and Warriors 3. Wizards and Warriors 3. Kuro's Visions of Power. By Acclaim Entertainment and um, blah blah blah. Rare Coinets. Licensed by Nintendo. Blah blah blah. This is obviously probably some sort of RPG or something, and there's some sort of mountain with a spike on it. Um, Bufa, um, no, some sort of like Merlin or something. I don't know. I can't think of names of these morons. Destroying the evil Markel and the evil and human enchanters. Spirit survived. King Arthur is holding up his sword on Mount Everest. And he's all looking around like, what the hell? Oh, hey, there's a giant, evil, hideous ghost monster. And it kicked King Arthur's ass. King Arthur is really a blowhard. In his weakened state, the wizard fled the scene of the battle. I, like, want to show the intro, but it's so stupid that I really want to skip it. So, there was this tower, and it was all pointy, and this guy with a goatee is all like, Bleh, I'm gonna blow up your tower or something. Maybe he's just gonna fly off into the distance for no reason. That's good, too. It's a very evil of him. Yeah, cold, hungry, and perilous. We've all been there. Yep, forest. Um, some sort of spoon. Um, hello, spoon monster. Please don't murder me. Oh, uh, what the hell? Like, it's some sort of dinosaur monster. I have no idea what's going on. Oh, hey, it gave us a sword. Thanks, spoon monster. Okay. But I don't... I don't even know what to say. I want to punch my screen every time I see that stupid ghost. Well, thankfully the ghost is gone, so... We're gonna go murder the king! That's what I assume this game is about. We are going to murder the false king and, uh... Hang his head on the door. Ah, Cam... The... Lynchon... 
sort of mystic code. Oops. What? This guy's doing a jaunty jig. He's Mr. Wilkes, Keeper of the Red Dwarf. Okay. He's got some serious power walking going on there. Oh, hey, there's um, his blue cousin, there's his green cousin, and there's his less green cousin. Okay, start the game, damn it. Okay. <laughs> I have to hold B and then press a direction to use the sword. It's deliciously awkward and pointless. We can dance a pretty good number, though. Check that shit out. Oh yeah. You wish you had moves like this. He's freaking night breakdancing, but verily we have more urgent duties than night breakdancing. So we must um, hop around on some random hovels. And thus, let's stab this guy. Come here, guy. Let me stab you. Oh, hey, a dog. Let's um, stab the dog. It looks mean, so let's um, stab it. Ah, no! My plan of stabbing things has backfired. More like randomly poking than stabbing, but gets the job done, oddly enough. Uh, let's stab this guy. <laughs> and he falls off the building and dies. This game is terrible. Right, hey, let's stab you. Ah! You have tricked me. I shall destroy you for your trickery. Ha! Foolish mortal. Hey! Get... My house. Or building. Whatever the hell these are. These... Well... The start button plays weird music. I'm glad that I can stab random townspeople that makes this game much more entertaining. I still have no idea what the hell's going on or what I'm supposed to do. Hey, Cookie! Cookie! Oh. Come here, Cookie. I will consume you. Damn it. The temptation of cookies is too great for a powerful wizard. Fortunately, the cookies were all lies and we cannot reach them. You must verily hold strong and ignore their temptation of cookies and uh, milk and stab random townsfolk because they wear, um, hey, they wear those Russian uh, fuzzy hats. It's not even winter. What's your problem, dude? Hey, stop punching me. Die. Well, I killed him, I guess. I killed an innocent person, so I feel pretty good about that. Don't feel good about being beaten up, though. Ha-ha! <laughs> you are vanquished, random fisherman. They, and I killed the dog, too. On accident. But hey. It's innocent, so it deserved to die. We're the bad guy in this story, right? I can't remember. No, go away. I shall vanquish you. Yeah, I move like a complete wuss for like a night. I'm like, yeah. I'm like freaking pogoing. Oh, hey, I got some sort of item thingy. Ha! Ah, I destroy you. No. Back, foul fiend. Back to the pits of hell with you. I guess that works too. Oh, right there, rightmost side of the screen. Hey, uh, that beehive hurts. Well, you are a worthy foe, beehive. I shall let you live this day. Cookie! Ugh. I was fooled by its deliciousness. I have been led astray. Seriously, what the hell am I supposed to do? There's absolutely no direction or anything. I'm just wandering around like a moron. 
Okay, I falsely assumed this would be better than that stupid Mario thing. I was completely wrong. I would have much rather played that stupid hack Mario lottery this entire video than even experience this. I just have no idea what the hell is going on. And even if I did, I doubt this would be any fun, so...